Now, life is going on as normal as possible here at Eastbrook Village, despite all that has happened in the last 24 hours just up the road at Kubrick Mountain Resort. Mountain officials have offered little to no comment on the SEC investigation or the state civil suit, but they're saying business is going on as usual. Now, almost a month ago, the total number of people that have been laid off has added up close to 200. However, residents are no stranger to the ongoing situation that has taken place. The town will continue to move forward just as Kubrick Martin feel they should. Reporting live from East Burk, I'm Victor Mwangi. Back to you. This is the kitchen where the St. John's Bay Academy culinary students have gained the skills to win the competition in the last five years in a row. They're hoping to continue the same momentum on Friday. Reporting for the Vermont Center for Community Journalism, I'm Victor Mwangi in St. John's Bay. I'm outside here in Lindenville, outside the Rural Edge organization, which is founded on helping struggling homeowners in the Northeast Kingdom. This year, they're seeking a grant worth $200,000. Reporting for the Vermont Center for Community Journalism, I'm Victor Mwangi in Lindenville.